Hi and welcome back to We Will Wonderfuls. In this video tutorial we're going to show you how to do a back loop only stitch. This is abbreviated in our patterns as BLO, written in capitals, and it simply stands for back loop only. Now when you're doing a normal double crochet, we go under both of the loops, like so. We go under both sides of the V stitch. With the back loop only, we're just going into the back loop. So the back loop is the one furthest away from you at the back. So we're just going to go into that half of the stitch here. So we're going to miss the front one and just go into the back one. So the front half is still there. Just go into the back one and then we're just going to carry on as normal with our double crochet stitch. Then we're going to go into the next back loop and it can be a little bit awkward. I tend to pop my hook through the middle of the stitch. So you're just under there and then carry on with your normal double crochet stitch. I'll try and show you a little bit clearer. So it's front, back. So we're just going to pop our hook down the middle. So we're just grabbing the back and doing that. Now, Watch out when you're doing the instruction because it may say back loop only but then it also may tell you to do increases and decreases. Um, so all you're doing on those is just using those back loops with all the stitches that it tells you to do. But these are just straight foldable crochets using the back loop. Now the, the reason this is obviously um, often used is because it gives us a nice edging like so it's given us a line. So we may use that for the edge of a hoof because it gives, you can see, it makes it go more like that. So it would be used for the base of a hoof, perhaps. Something where you would like a defined edge. So back loop only. Let's go in again. So just the back loop. And there we are. So the front loops are still there. And that is how to do the back loop only stitch. <laughs> 